Everything on Coruscant is huge. You see those city towers as we flew in? How many people you figure live in those? Millions? Looks like some of the city towers lost a few levels. Heard the Sith Empire hit this planet pretty hard. Even knocked the Jedi Temple off its pedestal. Wanna find Skalvik before we're too old to shoot straight? We're gonna need local help. Got someone particular in mind? I happen to know the perfect guy. There's a gambler named Darmus Polarin who keeps tabs on everything worth knowing about Coruscant. Good man. You'll like him. Worth a visit, I guess. Where do I find this Darmus? Bidu always said if you look for a sabacc table surrounded by beautiful women, you'll find Darmus. But I can narrow that down. I still have Vidu's hollow frequency contacts, and Darmus is one of them. Give me a second, and we'll talk to the man himself. Corso, is that you? It's been too long, you rascal. What brings you to Coruscant? A friend and I are in a real bind. Is there a place we can meet you? Of course. Come to my private cantina booth. I'm here now, winning my tenth hand of Sabacc against a very persistent rhodium. I hope you don't mind the occasional blast of fire. The cantina is in a rowdy part of Coruscant. Sounds like my kind of place. Do you know how to play Sabacc? If not, I'll teach you. It's the favorite game around here. Keep your comlink channel open, Darmus. I've got some bad news about V2. I'll bring Darmus up to speed while we travel, Captain. Keep your eyes open for that scum sucker who stole my ship. You got it. Welcome, my friend. I'm Darmus Polarin, a back player and information resource without equal. You seem to have a lot of female admirers. Women seem to find me irresistible. Just one more way, I'm an extremely fortunate man. Sorry to hear about Vidu. He was a man of refined taste and a terrible card player. I'll truly miss him. Life is like Sabak. The trick is to quit while you're ahead and enjoy your winnings. Exactly. How I'll spend my twilight years. I'll still be flying around this galaxy a hundred years from now. <laughs> I like your spirit, Captain. Sometimes I think I'm already too old for this business. Now, I know this isn't a social call. Corso says you have troubles, and I'm prepared to help. I want payback of a man named Skavik. Yes, Corso was equally emphatic about that. Having met Skavik, I understand completely. Skavik is well known in the galactic underworld. He's earned death sentences across the galaxy for everything from armed robbery to kidnapping. He's known to be in the Sith Empire's pocket, and he even cheats at cards. I'm happy to help you find him. If there's one thing I hate, it's a card cheat. In my book, if you can only win by cheating, you shouldn't be playing the game at all. Soon as Corso mentioned Skavik's name, I alerted all my best informants. I'm getting some interesting leads. What did I tell you, Captain? Darmus can find out anything. We'll have Skavik in no time. Let's hear Darmus's brilliant advice first. I don't offer advice, Captain. Only information. What you do with it is up to you. Skavik recently used the services of a data slicer named Kixi in the Migrant Merchant's Guild headquarters. Quite talented, I hear. What would Skavik need with a data slicer? Slicers are masters at cracking codes and manipulating data. Miscreant like Skavik will have all sorts of nefarious uses for such talent. Kixie might be able to help you flush Skavik out of hiding. Be careful, though. The guild is well-armed and doesn't like outsiders. Excuse me, but I noticed some delightful young ladies in desperate need of attention. Duty calls.
I must need some blasted data card to open this thing. There's bound to be somebody around here with a clearance pass. You ready for some more action, Captain? Let's find that slicer and see what she knows about Skadik. Been monitoring you on the security network. You sure know how to make an entrance. Guess we found our slicer. But why does this room look like a prison? Because it is a prison. Thanks for noticing. Whatever issues you're having with the guild, I'm on your side. I'm just a slave here. I'm not here to blast you. Then is there any chance you're here to free me? Because I'm definitely ready to not be here. The guild locked me up two years ago. Forced me to work for them. I'll do anything to get out. What do you need? We'll be on Skavik's trail and I'll free you. Finding his trail is easy. Just look for the slime. I knew that Corellian pig lizard Skavik had ticked off the wrong person. No wonder he was in such a hurry. Skavik paid the guild to clean his identity record. They made me slice into the Republic's main database and delete all his arrest warrants. You just cracked open the Republic's database and changed things? It's what I do. The Republic administrators never even knew I was there. Sorry, but that's all I know about Skavik. I'm not sure how else to help you. I want you to make that scum's life miserable. I don't know about miserable, but I think I can put him on the defensive. Take away his spotless identity record, and Skavik can't walk ten meters without attracting attention. He'll be a lot easier to find. I can ruin Skavik's identity record for you in no time. If I do that, will you let me go? I want Skavik's record dirtier than a sewer on Hutta. In other words, just the way I found it. No problem. I saved copies of everything I erased from Skavik's identity record. All I have to do now is transfer the data back. There. Easy. The minute he passes an identity checkpoint, it'll trigger an alarm. What else can you do to Skavik's identity record? Depends on how much damage you're looking to inflict. Frame him as an undercover Republic law enforcement agent. You really hate him, don't you? Alright, I'll plant files with all the criminal syndicates, so they think Skavik is a lawman. Okay, let me go now, so I can make it out before they lock this place down. I was always planning to let you go. Thank you, you're my hero. Maybe we should go check in with Darmus, see if he's got any new info on Skavik. An informant spotted you leaving the Migrant Merchants Guild. I trust Kixie was useful? Kixie did a real number on Skavik's identity record. On a world this crowded with people and technology, he can't hide for long. My sources reveal Skavik is doing business with the Black Sun Gang. A dangerous friendship for all sorts of reasons. Black Sun is notorious for keeping holo recordings of all their meetings. No doubt they preserve the highlights of Skavik's visit. Bring me up to speed on this gang. After the Empire sacked Coruscant, the worst criminal scum organized and called themselves Black Sun. A bit theatrical, if you ask me. Black Sun fragments its recordings over several computers to prevent unauthorized viewing. You'll have to assemble the relevant footage by accessing each computer. I should warn you, Black Sun controls an entire sector of Coruscant. They're thugs with the most horrible manners. Do be careful. Good luck. Well, well. The Jackal of the Stars himself pays me a visit. Long time no see, Skavik. You must really need my help, huh? Urbax, buddy, you're such a cynical guy. Can't I just be paying an old friend a visit? You and friends is the funniest thing I've heard all year. Get to the point before I stop laughing. Long man from the outer rim is sticking to me like a Minoc on a power coupling. I need somebody to scrape him off. Lawman, huh? Sounds like that'll cost you double. Whatever it takes. Look, I'm in a rush to wrap up with the business here. Besides, find a word for my friends makes me feel good. Nice. So where is this little parasite you want me to remove? He's at a docking bay in the spaceport, and he's alone. I'm sure he won't give a burly scrapper like you much trouble. I guarantee he won't. Oh, and I'll be wanting my payment in advance. I wouldn't have it any other way, Urbax. You enjoy yourself. It might be this lawman knows how to find Skalik. We'd better try to save him. Let's go bust up that party at the spaceport, Captain. This was fun, little mouse. But we're done playing. Time to die. Yang wei wa wa la wa ku pu la bo xia ba xi, you ren gao shao wa na zhuang ga. 
I can't figure out if this Celestin's deaf or just stupid. You see those ears? Celestins have excellent hearing. I told you idiot to watch that door! Do I have to do everything myself? This is none of your business, scum. Get out while you still can. I'm sure if we ask them real nicely, they'll just leave. You heard the man, lawbreakers. Surrender now, or else. You really are as dumb as you look, aren't you? Kill them both, men. Sticking up for the little guy is what I do best. I don't need to know your name, and I'm not giving mine. I'm hunting Skavik too. He stole my starship. I'm not promising anything, but I'll do what I can. Keep my name out of that report, all right? Let's not be here when the local security shows up. We don't have time to answer questions. Maybe we should go see if Darmus knows anything new about Skavik. See? what I tell you? It's the captain from Rogue on the Butcher's bounty posting. Are we lucky or what? I never doubted you for a second, lover. You've always been my lucky star. Ugh, you two make me sick. Hold it right there, Captain. Is that a hairstyle, or did a womp rat die in your head? Did you just... What did... Who do you... Shut up! Come on, you two. Let's cremate this fool and get rich. You kids run home to your mamas before I spank you. All right, that's it. Let's roast this stupid nerf herder. He's off, Scorch. I have a bad feeling about this, Captain. Looks like more than we can handle. Not man enough for a real challenge? Don't know what you see in this guy, Igara. More than you could ever show me. Rilo, this bounty's worth more money than we could earn in a month. All right, lover, but stay behind me. I don't want you getting hurt over a lousy stack of credits. Listen to me, I'm, I'm not who you think I am. Oh, please, that's what they all say. I bet you've killed a lot of innocent people. I never flame-broiled anybody who didn't have it coming. Except for that Rodian droid technician. And the Trandoshan cloth merchant. And your last girlfriend. Uh, what was her name? Mira? Marzi? It was Morella, and that was an accident! You said this was the captain from Rogue and the Butcher's bounty. Are you sure or not? I don't know. I thought I was. You wouldn't kill me on a hunch, would you? Let's... let's get out of here. I think I made a mistake. Oh, come on! I want to fry somebody! I hope you find the real bounty. Why'd you bring up Morella in front of a total stranger? That was just cold. Having some trouble with bounty hunters, Captain? I can't help that I'm popular with all the wrong people. Being famous has its drawbacks, doesn't it? I hear Black Sun's on an emergency recruitment drive, and you had an altercation at the spaceport. I take it my lead was worthwhile. Skavik will be riding on the floor before this is over. That's quite the vicious streak. It seems he brings out the worst in people. While we wait for Skavik to make his next move, perhaps we could play a little Sabak? I saw that one coming. Or so, don't be such a spoiled sport. What do you say, Captain? First game's on me. What's the harm in a friendly game of cards? Don't say I didn't warn you, Captain. Get us a round of drinks, won't you, Corso? There's a good man. Let's deal some cards. You win again. That was... Very impressive. Impressive? <laughs> the captain just cleaned your chrono, Darmus. 
Hmm, I'd say you've played this game before. I never said I was a beginner. And I'm a victim of my assumptions. Well played, my friend. Hold on. I'm receiving an alert from my network. This may be what we've been waiting for. Looks like your efforts have paid off, Captain. My informants just witnessed Skavik fighting someone and fleeing into Justicar's territory. We have him. Who are these Justicars? The vigilantes, self-appointed judges of a whole city sector. Executioners is more like it. The Justicars don't tolerate outsiders in their sector. Skavik must truly be desperate to risk his life going there. I'm not letting some Justicar kill Skavik before I do. Then you'd better hurry. Justicars aren't known for their mercy. My informants are a brother and sister named Jick and Jewel. They know where to find Skavik. I'll tell them you're coming. Play your hand carefully in the Justicar sector. My instincts tell me Skavik hasn't shown all his cards yet. Don't worry. Nothing's gonna stop me. Good luck to you, Captain. I hope you make Skavik pay all his debts. The Captain, right? About time you got here. Thanks to you, the Justicar snagged my brother Jick. Should have never tangled ourselves in your cloudhead business. What do you mean by cloudhead? You're from where the air is thin and heads are soft. This is Turferland. Wise up and grab some ground. I'm Jewel. My brother Jick and I were watching Skavik for you. Big mistake. Nothing but trouble. Things always go bad for Turfers when cloudheads come down here. Never should have took this job. Are you done berating me yet? I haven't even started. You kept me worrying and waiting a long time. Jick and I were tailing Skavik when the Justicars came after us. Jick stuck to Skavik. I drew the Justicars. I lost those helmet brains easy, but they snagged Jick and hauled him off to their detention center. Sounds like you're fresh out of luck. Unless you count the bad kind. You better wise up and start caring about me and my brother. Jick knows where Skavik went, but he didn't have time to spill it to me before they snagged him. You want Skavik? Better prowl into the Justicar's detention center and free my brother. Why can't things be easy just once? This is life in Turferland. Welcome to it. Once inside the detention center, you have to bash all the Justicar droid eyes. That's how they track intruders. If those droid eyes aren't rubble, the Justicars will know your face. You don't want that. Are you making up more words? I've never heard of a droid eye before. Whatever you call them. It's tech that watches the hallways, okay? Don't just stand there goggling at me. Get Jake out of that detention center before something happens to him. Something may have already happened to your brother. Don't say that. If anything happens to Jick, you won't ever find Skavik. Take this hollow transmitter with you. I want to talk to Jake as soon as you free him. CJ Yapai Weipu Mubu Duba Defene. Stand still, I want to get a hold of this. You were supposed to contact me when you found Skavik. The Justicars are a bunch of crazy vigilantes. Might as well spring the little fellow while we're here. After this, you're on your own. I'm really not an upstanding citizen. <sighs> I feel like my insides are coming out. On your feet, Chick. Let's get you out of here. <laughs> You're definitely not a Justicar. All they ever called me was gutter scum. Chick, it's me, Jewel. Are you alright? What did those Justicars do to you? Hey, sis. 
knew you wouldn't forget about me. Who's the Cloudhead? The Captain Darmus asked us to help. What happened when you followed Skavik? How come the Justicar snagged you? Saw something I wasn't supposed to. You won't believe this, but I caught the Justicars trading supplies with the Empire. All I care about is getting my hands on Skavik. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot about him. What with the beatings and torture. Skavik and the Imperials were laughing about something. I'm not sure what. The Imperials took Skavik into the works. I never heard of this place. What's it like? It's a big mess of power stations and old factories below us. I didn't think anything could survive down there except droids. If Skavik dropped to the works, you may as well go home. You wouldn't last five minutes. We're pretty good. Bet we last ten minutes. The works is nothing but toxic runes and berserk droids. People who go down there, don't come back. If Skavik and the Imperials can survive down there, so can I. You're a lot braver than I thought. Or dumber. I'd like to go home now. This is the worst party I've ever been to. Jick, remember the tunnel we found? Crawl in and come to the warehouse. I'll hide you from the Justicars. <sighs> Great. I'm gonna smell like Rancor droppings for a week. Thanks for busting me out, Captain. You did good, kid. Kid? I'm almost as old as you. Jick, take my hollow transmitter from the captain before you leave. I'm not letting you out of my sight. Don't be so dramatic. There's only a little torture. Good luck down in the works, Captain. You'll need it. The Marusta Van Ruby. It's even more exquisite than I imagined. This will be the perfect centerpiece for my gift to the Grand Morph. Sure to learn you a nice fad promotion. Maybe the Grand Moff will finally let you go home to Droman Kaas. What's your turn, Skalak? My agent is standing by at the spaceport ready to deliver the item. You have someone ready to receive it? There's a twitchy little starship merchant named Fabazan in my docking bay. He'll accept my payment. Lieutenant, transmit the signal. I don't know what you want with that grotesque trophy, Skalak, but it's all yours now. Need any other priceless relics, Commander? Just let me know. Your thieving days are over, Skavik. Is it too much to ask that someone guard the entrance to our secret base? Captain, seriously, I admire your persistence, but this is ridiculous. How do you know this man, Scavik? He's an acquaintance who just can't take a joke. You're gonna be a floor stain when we're done with you, Skavik. Or so. I heard about your job. Hey, don't let unemployment make you bitter, all right? You're the one who followed up my identity record and sent half the galaxy chasing me? That wasn't very nice, Captain. That's nothing compared to what's next. Haven't you had enough revenge for one day? Framing me with the crime syndicates wasn't very nice. You know how hard it is to get out of trouble with them? Oh, oh wait, that's right. You do. I heard Rogan the Butcher just raised the price on your head. Congratulations. Enough of this. The Captain is your problem, Skavak. Deal with it. Commander, would you mind vaporizing the Captain for me? I've got places to be. Skavak! Blast that scoundrel, always leaving me to clean up his messes. You could just let me go. No, and I'm afraid you won't be leaving here. We'll give you a very nice unmarked grave. Who do you think you are giving me orders? You're as good as dead, you alien filth. Just what I needed. Officer Chatterbox is here to save the day. Why didn't you let me handle those Imperials myself? Poor little guy. He didn't deserve to go out like this. We see while I okay, Denny. Jeez, Kakava Koyota. Do banda, Bakawonki. Three words, pal. Where's my ship? Look at the Yompi, but one any bobo, Chobaduma. The Pisca Kukapa mi wata. Potenya nocha to pota. Do what do you musta? O grand retempo do mokitonka. 
Ojibo, Uben Kornal P. Isti Patoka. For the last time, where's my starship? Niskangri Topat, Bombo Kita Kum Boska Bulya? Jeska Koli Raka Kanchanga, Bomba Kumchinka. Not yet. But you owe the captain something for all his trouble. What room at the water done we want to eat with Koba As long as Skavik's paying, I'm buying. Do what do you must, more grand retain for the Muki Donka? You can tabata chawa, uermo, mukili mawa hota? Fui bani aga tweepi taboka donka, wana waka. Beat it before I shoot you. No bongo wa uni kupa. Don't eat talk, maki togi. Chokchi wampa la hagwachi kuska, wampa sa topiska. Taking a wild guess that my life just got a new kind of complicated. Funny, I don't remember leaving a beautiful woman in my cargo hold. Must be my lucky day. Depends on your definition of lucky. My name's Risha. I've been traveling with Skavik as part of a business arrangement. He and I had a deal to deliver the things you see here. Skavik isn't known for honoring his deals. Then maybe my luck is about to change. Skavik was going to deliver this cargo. But he's proving unreliable. I think you might be a much better partner. Lady, I barely know you. Why would I agree to any deal? Because I'm willing to earn your trust. The real question is, will you give me the chance to make you rich? What do you know? That's Skavik on the ship's hollow. This should be an interesting conversation. You're late, Skavik. And I just made a new friend. I think you two will loathe each other. Congratulations, Captain. You're officially number one on my list of people to kill. When I get my hands on you, you'll wish you'd never left Lord Mandel. Come and get me anytime you want. Well, you can bet on it, and I guarantee you won't see me coming. Don't know how you got away from those Imperials, but next time, I'll kill you myself. Assuming Rogue and the Butcher doesn't get you first. I sold all those blasters you were supposed to deliver for him on Lord Mantel. I, I can't imagine he'll be happy that you lost them. I'll make sure Rogan hears who really fouled things up for him. I'm sure you'll have lots to say while Rogan tortures you to death. Are you done posturing, Skavik? The captain and I have cargo to deliver. Don't even think about cutting me out of this deal, Risha. Finders keepers. Isn't that what you always say? Not my fault the captain here beat you to the big prize. Sweetheart, you two just made the biggest mistake of your lives. Thought that blowhard would never switch off. So, we were discussing how I can make you fabulously wealthy. The items here are pieces to a key. A key that unlocks the lost treasure of a very rich dead man named Nokdrayan. Who's Nokdrayan? Please tell me you're joking. The man was a criminal legend. Nokdrayan was the greatest gangster who ever lived. He personally wiped out the Wrath Cartel and the Vandal Helm Combine during the Syndicate Wars. When he died ten years ago, Nok had more wealth than some Outer Rim worlds. Even the Huts were jealous. What happened to Nock's fortune after he died? Now we're getting to the interesting part. Nock hid his fortune right before he died. For ten years, treasure hunters across the galaxy have searched for it, in vain. Until now. You see, I've finally figured out how to get the lost riches of Nock Drayan. You're my new best friend, Risha. That's sweet. But let's try to keep this professional for now. Whoever gets Nock's riches will become an underworld legend. Skavik had his chance and blew it. Now it's your turn. Help me deliver these things in your cargo hold, and Nokdrayan's wealth will be all yours. What are you getting out of this? I'm after something personal. The money doesn't mean anything to me, Captain. I'm the only one that can help you trade these items to get Nokdrayan's treasure. But I won't tell you everything up front. To get the riches, you trust me the same way I trust you. One step at a time. Deal? We'll see if this treasure hunt of yours is worth it. Once you get a taste of this job, I think you'll be hooked. 
We have deals set up on Taris and Narshada. I'll make all the arrangements and introductions for you on both planets. Until then, I'll be in my bunk. That caged beast there isn't much good for conversation, so come visit me if you feel like chatting. I'll be around for anything you need, sweetheart. Anything. That's a comfort. Looking forward to working with you, Captain. <laughs>